So Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police? El día de hoy tenemos una clase con dibujos animados. Estaremos viendo el capítulo de hoy totalmente en inglés con los subtítulos en inglés, pero no te preocupes si no logras entender todo. Al final del pequeño episodio estaremos repasando toda la conversación de nuestros personajes, logrando así aprender muchísimas cosas. Así que ahora sí, comencemos. So Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police before? Um, yeah, actually I have once. I got a speeding ticket one time. <laughs> Were you driving? Um, yeah, I was driving a scooter and well, I was going a little bit too fast and the police <laughs> were fast. a little bit too fast. <laughs> and the police were around the corner and yeah, they have the speed camera. Yeah. And picked me up on that and then pulled me over and Did you have to pay? For yes, any fine? I did. I had to pay a fine and I was very sad. Yeah, to I do don't that. like the paying money part. <laughs> okay, maybe you shouldn't drive then. No. I'm a I can drive, but I'm not going to drive that fast. Okay, then maybe you should drive safely and Safe. slowly. Slowly. Okay. La conversación comienza el chico preguntándole a Hannah, ¿alguna vez ha sido parada o detenida por la policía? So, Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police before? So, Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police before? So, Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police before? Entonces, Hannah, ¿alguna vez ha sido detenida por la policía? A lo que ella responde. Uh, yeah, actually I have once. I got a speeding ticket one time. Realmente me detuvieron una vez. Recibí una multa por velocidad una vez. Ah, uh, yeah, actually I have once. I got a speeding ticket one time. Ah, uh, yeah, actually I have once. I got a speeding ticket one time. Were you driving? Were you driving? Were you driving? Estabas conduciendo? Yeah, I was driving a scooter. Sí, estaba conduciendo un scooter. Estos scooters son estas pequeñas motocicletas muy populares en los Estados Unidos. Yeah, I was driving a scooter and well, I was going a little bit too fast and the police Sí, estaba conduciendo la scooter y iba un poco demasiado rápido. Entonces la policía luego ya continúa contando la historia de cómo la detuvieron. Dice, And the police were around the corner. The police were around the corner. La policía estaba al doblar la esquina. La policía estaba haciendo su trabajo around the corner, justo en la esquina. Y ella continúa diciendo, And yeah, they have the speed camera. And they pick me up on that and then pull me over. And they pick me up on that and then pull me over. And they pick me up on that. Pick me significa recoger. Pero en este caso se está utilizando para referirse a que la atraparon. Pick me up. On that, me atraparon con eso. They pick me up on that and then, y entonces, pull me over. Pull over significa ahorillarse. Cuando usted le dice pull over, pull over the car, es algo que se hace más con los carros o con cualquier vehículo. Pull over significa estacionarse, ahorillarse. Ponerse a un lado y detenerse. Did you have to pay a fine? Did you have to pay a fine? Did you have to pay a fine? Este fine, que es el fine de toda la vida que usted conoce, que significa bien, también puede llegar a significar multa. Multa. ¿Tuviste que pagar una multa? ¿Tuviste que pagar una multa? Did you have to pay a fine? Did you have to pay a fine? Did 
you have to pay a fine. Así que ya sabe, este es otro significado que puede llegar a tener la palabra fine. Téngalo pendiente. Ella responde diciendo, Yes, I did. I have to pay a Yes, I did. I had to pay a fine. And I was very sad to do that. Yes, I did. I had to pay a fine. And I was very sad to do that. Sí, lo tuve que hacer. Tuve que pagar una multa. Y estaba muy triste de hacer eso. Luego él dice, Yeah, I don't like the pain money part. Yeah, I don't like the pain money part. Sí, no me gusta la parte de tener que pagar dinero. Yeah, I don't like the pay money part. Yeah, I don't like the pay money part. Ok, maybe you shouldn't drive then. Entonces quizás no deberías conducir. Ok, maybe you shouldn't drive then. Ok, maybe you shouldn't drive then. A lo que él responde, I can drive, but I'm not going to drive that fast. I can drive, but I'm not going to drive that fast. Sé conducir, pero no voy a conducir así de rápido. I can drive, but I'm not going to drive that fast. Y ella termina diciendo, Ok, then maybe you should drive safely and slowly. Está bien, entonces quizás tú deberías conducir seguro y suave. Ok, then maybe you should drive safely and slowly. Y así termina la conversación. Muy interesante. Ahora que ya usted vio los detalles de cómo Hannah fue detenida, tanto en español como en inglés, Creo que usted está listo para ver este corto episodio sin traducción ni subtítulos. Recuerde que ya repasó todo el vocabulario, así que solamente tiene que prestar atención para que logre entender en su totalidad. ¿Está listo? Let's do it. So, Hannah, have you ever been stopped by police before? Um, yeah, actually, I have. Once I got a speeding ticket one time. <laughs> Were you driving? Um, yeah, I was driving a scooter and well, I was going a little bit too fast and the police <laughs> were fast. a little bit too fast <laughs> and the police were around the corner and yeah, they have the speed camera Yeah. and picked me up on that and then pulled me over and did you have to pay? Yes, I did. I had to pay a fine and I was very sad yeah to i do don't that. like the paying money part <laughs> okay maybe you shouldn't drive then no. i'm a i can drive but i'm not gonna drive that fast okay then maybe you should drive safely and Safe. slowly slowly okay llegó el momento de short quiz un examen rápido quiero que contestes las siguientes preguntas acerca de la historia intenta responder en inglés con las palabras que aprendiste. Bien, ahí vamos. Primera pregunta. Why she was pulled over for? Why she was pulled over for? ¿Por qué la detuvieron? Excellent. Because she was driving too fast. Because she was driving too fast. BM. What she was driving. What she was driving. Que ella estaba conduciendo. Excellent. She was driving a scooter. She was driving a scooter. Did she have to pay a fine? Ella tuvo que pagar una multa? Yes, 
she had to pay a fine. Y bueno amigos, hasta aquí la clase del día de hoy. Espero que les haya gustado. Si les gusta este tipo de clases con animaciones interactivas, déjenmelo saber en los comentarios para seguir trayendo este tipo de clases. Recuerda darle like al video y suscribirte. Al... Estamos realizando clases casi todos los días. No estamos fallando. Así que activa la campanita y suscríbete. Nos vemos en la próxima clase. Dios te bendiga. Si llegaste a este punto del video, escribe Apple en los comentarios. See you later.